In 2008, pro and anti-rail groups formed and battled over both the rail referendum and the Hanneman re-election. Keith Rollman, a city official and campaign advisor, claimed he'd been smeared by someone impersonating him on the Internet, bragging about political dirty tricks. Rollman demands an investigation. Good evening, I'm Larry Yamada. Paula Akana has the night off. Well, KITV4 News has obtained the results of a criminal investigation which ended with a shocking twist. Prosecutors reported that the city official who asked for the investigation, Keith Rollman, was also involved in anonymous Internet attacks on critics of Rail and Mayor Hanneman. Rollman answered those allegations in an exclusive interview with KITV4's Daryl Huff. I'm going to pursue the individual who's responsible. Have you ever been involved in any smear tactics in any previous campaigns? No. That complaint from Mayor Hanneman's appointee and campaign media advisor Keith Rollman kicked off a two-year police and prosecutor investigation, including search warrants and computer forensics. GOP and anti-rail activist Eric Ryan was identified as the suspect in the crime of harassing Rollman by impersonation. But the prosecutor found Rollman was also engaged in anonymous Internet attacks. I can't believe this document say, it would say or imply that we were doing the same thing because I never forged someone's name to a document. I never pretended to be somebody else uh, for the purpose of entrapping them in basically blackmailing them. Rollman admitted using the screen name Bob W., among others, on an anonymous blog calling for the university to fire rival mayor candidate Panos Prevedoras. The prosecutor's letter said both Rollman and Eric Ryan were posting lewd and racist comments and cartoons. Rollman says he used adult humor, but was never lewd or racist. Yes, uh, I participated in online blogs under names uh, other than my own uh, on my own time. This is not something that I sat there on the taxpayer's dime doing on a daily basis. Did the mayor know you were doing this? I didn't discuss it with him. Roman said he may have used his city computer, but not on city time, and does not feel his city or campaign positions demanded a higher ethical standard. Doesn't that reflect on the mayor at all? Well, that sounds like a, a really good reason to use a pseudonym, doesn't it? To if you have something mayor? to say, or yourself. The issues prosecutors learned about Keith Rollman made them decide not to prosecute Eric Ryan, even though this letter said they believed they had evidence to prove guilt beyond a reasonable doubt. Eric Ryan is now employed here at City Hall in the office of Councilman Tom Berg. Reporting from Honolulu Holly, Daryl Huff, KITV 4 News. Eric Ryan refused comment. Former Mayor Hanneman did not return calls to his cell phone or to his office. Now, there's more on this story on our website and also on civilbeat.com, whose reporters assisted in our investigation.